Hey guys, Caleb here. Um, today we're going to be going over Proverbs 14-12. Uh, this is really hard for me to pick which verse to go with because in this chapter, there's just so much, um, so many different uh, subjects. There's everything from taking care of a house to taking care of a farm, which is sounds silly, but it's in there. And then it also talks about... Um, court matters such as in dealing with the government and then it goes back to wisdom a lot in there because you know wisdom's all throughout proverbs it's just it's crazy um well, i went with proverbs fourteen twelve, and this is the esv version and it says there is a way that seems right to a man but its end is the way to death um it reminded me a lot of what it was something kind of like what my pastor preached on a couple of weeks ago, and and it's a principle he's has mentioned a few times, which says basically what may seem right isn't always right, but what is right will eventually feel right, and sometimes what seems right does feel right even though it's not right, and that's uh, hard to understand, but. This verse is just a, it's a general principle that, that can be applied in many circumstances. Um, it basically says what is right in our eyes is not to be the standard. Just because something seems right, you shouldn't live by it. Because um, it'll lead to anarchy. It did. There's a good example for of it in Judges 17.6. I'm not going to go into all that. But um, in Israel, it... It tore it apart. It just, you know, it went crazy. Um, it's gonna be a really short video because this is really hard for me to break apart and make it sound simple. Because I know it doesn't sound simple and it probably doesn't make any sense to you guys at all. But leave here with this: spiritual truth is a mystery. It's something not found out by human reason, but it's revealed to man by God. So what is right will always come from God. And what may seem right in our eyes shouldn't be the standard we live by. And that's all I got for you guys. I'm um, sorry that was really confusing. It was really confusing for me too. I read it and read it and read it and prayed and prayed and prayed. Um, and I did the best I could. So I hope you guys got something out of it. Uh, love you guys. Bye.